Hi, I'm Chris Tagg. Welcome to this week's Repair Tag. Robert finished up the Artley 9.0 flute overhaul this week. It really came out nice, and I think he's rather proud of it. A client brought in this very old Martin guitar. We did not repair this guitar, but we were able to look at it while evaluating some other instruments for him. We believe this one is from the 1890s. Josh worked on this nice Selmer Paris trumpet this week. It's a K-modified lightweight model 24B from 1967. This one had some damage to the bell and a few dents in the bell bow which Josh removed. Another client wanted me to add some strap mounts to his Yamaha trumpet case so he can wear it as a backpack. I also added a strap ring to the lid so he can attach his mute bag. Being a college student, freeing up his hands for carrying other things is rather important. I finished my client's Buffet R13 clarinet overhaul this week also. As I was floating the cork pads, I found that several tone holes were not as level as they appeared at first. Not having the tool I needed, I went to the lathe and fabricated a tool to level the tone holes. After re-leveling them, I restored the chimney by resurfacing the outer and inner edges of the tone holes. Having corrected the key fit issues and floated all the pads, I finished the regulation and test played it. The cork pads really made this clarinet speak cleanly and gave the keys a very positive feel. Be sure to watch next week for some test playing footage. Well, that does it for this week's episode. Tune in next week for the latest episode of Repair Tag.